Hey guys, it's Anna with Kaiju Bites. I know it's been a long time since I've posted any videos. Um, I was actually concentrating on my other channel, channel, Anna Travels, which you should go check it out and subscribe. I was trying to get it to a thousand. I'm in 750 area, so not quite at a thousand, but we're getting there. Um, and I just wasn't feeling inspired to post that much about on this channel. Um, I wasn't doing that much shopping for personal reasons. Um, so nothing to really show off kaiju related. And I just wasn't eating as, I mean, we were eating, but I don't know, just haven't been posting. But I noticed over the holidays, my like subs count actually like increased during my absence. And I actually do need to go to the mall, which I'm actually already at the mall, to do some shopping. Um, and the last time we were here, uh, there was a lot of Godzilla merchandise. I think with the new movies, people are more into Godzilla. And so, yeah, so I'm going to do some shopping and we're going to do some eating. Um, I had breakfast, but it's almost lunchtime and I'm going to see what the Potomac Mills food court has in store. It's been a while since I've been to Potomac Mills, the food court in general. Um, usually I don't eat at the mall. Usually when we go to the mall, we shop and then we just go to one of the restaurants that's around the area. So we'll see what our options are and then we'll see what I got. Probably save that for home, but let's, let's get, let's see what Godzilla stuff we can find. Got Godzilla all over the place. Here's that Godzilla vs. Kong soda, the Mecha Godzilla. Got cereals, different Japanese type items. Oh, Kit Kats. King Kong fleece. It's not that soft though. Yeah, it's not that soft. Oh, oh, it's just a toy. King Kong. I hope gift wraps it. Got pajamas. We have a Godzilla Monopoly set. That's pretty cool. Oh, and Jenga. I've seen the Godzilla Jenga set. And they have this cute guy. And then King Ghidorah. Candy bar. And a cherry chili chipotle dark chocolate. And there's more shirts. More shirts. And then a hoodie. I have my hand full with the other hand, so I can't really show off the hoodie, but it's pretty cool. So I got some Godzilla stuff. Well, I'll show you guys later. And then I got some lunch. There's like a lot of different options now at Potomac Mills. They have like an Indian place, they have great wraps. They have Burger King who's been here forever. A Poke Ria, which replaced a horribly, horrible, I think it was a Japanese ripoff or a Chinese it had horrible reviews and it tasted awful. Chili steak. It's kind of hard to see. It's like some sort of Tex-Mex. Then Popeye's Mandarin. Something that's closed. Sabaro, which you don't see much. The Cajun Grill, which is actually not Cajun, but Chinese. And then a Japanese place over there. And then some miscellaneous candy shops and uh, some ramen place. Oh, and Haagen-Dazs. haagen has been here forever. So I got the typical bourbon chicken from the Cajun joint, which is really just a Chinese place. Um, I'm craving bourbon chicken. So I got lo mein, fried rice, and bourbon chicken. This place sometimes is amazing, sometimes this place is average. But he tossed a fresh, fresh batch of the chicken so it shouldn't be terrible. Hopefully not. So 
I'm gonna give the fried rice a try. Hmm. It's just kind of on the dry side, but it's fried rice. I mean, this is not gourmet food. And I forgot that you can ask them to put a little bit more sauce in the bourbon chicken. I totally forgot that. It's been like before COVID since I've eaten in the food court at Potomac Mills or actually any mall. Um, I've only been to the mall at least, I think like four times since COVID. I mean, I never really liked the mall in the first place, but since COVID, it's kind of made it worse. <laughs> so I avoided it uh, pretty much all through COVID. But let's give this bourbon chicken a try. It's a little dry. I think I should have asked for a little bit of more of the bourbon sauce. Mm, that piece is a lot better because I have more sauce on it. So, let's give this lo mein, chow mein, whatever they want to call it. And that's pretty plain. So, I mean, for a mall food joint, it's average. It's not it's not blowing your pants off, but it's not terrible. But anyways, um, I'll meet you at the house and we'll see what I got Godzilla-wise. Hey guys, so I am, I recorded me trying everything, but then I wasn't happy with the footage, so I'm re-recording it. Um, hopefully it will be better. Um, so I'll show you, I got the pants. I end up getting the lounger pants or sleep pants or pajama pants, whatever you want to call them, of the King Kong, I mean the Godzilla vs. Kong um, from the, was it last year that the movie came out? Uh, the years are blurring together. I'm pretty sure it was last year. Um, I like the movie. I don't know if I ever did a review. I probably did. I can't remember anymore. Um, so the chocolates, the chocolates were each good. I'm not going to try them again because I've, um, just because I, I'm maxed out on sugar at the moment. But the King Ghidorah, it was dark chocolate with dragon fruit. Now, I have no basis for dragon fruit. I've never had dragon fruit. Um, so I don't know what it tastes like. <laughs> but it tasted like a fruity dark chocolate. It was really good. Um, and then this one, the Mecha Godzilla. Try not to pour it all out. It had, it's milk chocolate with pretzels, sea salt, chili chipotle and peanuts um so when I ate it I really it you definitely taste the milk chocolate you taste the saltiness from like the pretzels maybe the peanuts as well but then at the then like the lingering like then you hit with the chili chipotle like it's it's a very kind of like at the end um it was good I'm not huge with the whole spicy chocolate thing but I get it and it and it's good like it's not a bad not bad chocolate um and then the mothra chocolate is um well one I, I'll show you the color it's like bright orange um this one was my favorite actually it actually tasted like it's blood orange with white confection with poppy with, with popping candy um it tastes like an orange sickle or like orange and cream um, so that one was my favorite <laughs> and then I got the Mecha Godzilla colossal cherry soda um, I will show you what my reaction because it's been pretty consistent oh it tastes like cherry medicine um, could it be better cold maybe that could help save it I highly doubt it but <sighs> It's pretty awful. I think that's just gonna, I might keep the bottle, but oh, it is not good. So yeah. So that was my little shopping spree. Um, I'm not gonna say I'm gonna post that much. Like, you know, I'm not gonna post like every week now, but um, as I want to post, I'll post. Uh, so I hope you like and subscribe. Join me for future videos. Um, I do wanna do a little bit more, you know, snack videos and also um, other videos related to unboxings and stuff. I just, <laughs> Um, I just haven't done much lately, um, but hopefully I can get into a groove back with this channel. But anyways, guys, that was just a little bit of my haul. I'm glad you joined me, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!